this new study, a bloke injected himself with increasing doses of lethal snake venom as protection in case any of his snakes bit him. Has this thought ever crossed your mind? Oh gosh, no. I would, <laughs> no. The, the way that I'd, I try to survive death is to not invite it. They can be incredibly deadly. And this guy, you read his story, he's been to hospital a number of times, nearly died, mm. you know, many times. Who knows what sort of long-term effects that this guy's going to have, like on his kidneys or even just things as he gets older, you know, your, your body has had to deal with a lot of onslaught. So mm. no, I, I would not recommend doing what he did. I wouldn't recommend that to anyone. It's a warning for people that under no circumstance, if they've got snakes, should they try to self immunize, you know, especially in Australia, my goodness, we've got great quality anti-venoms. Not all snakes are venomous, obviously. Some like pythons are not. Yes, something I prepared earlier. Hello, darling. Here's our snake representative. So this is a Woma python, not totally full grown. She can maybe get half that length again. The species lives in the arid interior of Australia. And they're a real keystone species because they actually dig burrows. And if you live in the desert, you're a little antichinus or, you know, something that needs to escape the heat and, and also the extreme cold. How you do that is by going underground. Mm. And Woma pythons dig those burrows. Here she is. I'll give you the camera a nice little view. 